Welcome back to KSN News at 5. A new study is looking into the link between type 2 diabetes and meat. KSN's Aditi Lamba joins us now with what that study found. Aditi. Julia Jeff, the study suggests that reducing meat consumption, especially processed and red meats, could be beneficial in lowering the risk of type 2 diabetes. More than 13,000 Kansans are diagnosed with diabetes every year, according to the American Diabetes Association. I spoke with the association's director of nutrition and wellness, Stacey Krosik. The study did find that people who ate a serving of uh, processed meat every day were 15% more likely to develop type 2 diabetes later in life. She says physical inactivity and obesity also contribute to a higher risk of type 2 diabetes. The study found people who eat red and processed meat every day have a 15% increased chance of developing type 2 diabetes. The American Diabetes Association says healthy meal patterns are important in reducing your risk. So you have half your plates coming from non-starchy vegetables, a quarter of your plate coming from a lean protein source, Notably here, we're talking about less processed um, tr um, protein sources. And then a quarter from quality carbohydrates like starchy vegetables, whole grains, fruit, and low-fat dairy. She also repeats what we all know. Staying active is key to reducing the risk of obesity and type 2 diabetes. She says in Kansas, about a third of adults are obese. And losing 10% of your weight can greatly reduce your risk. Here for you, Aditi Lamba, KSN News 3.